Bears legend Steve McMichael admitted to ICU one week after Hall of Fame election. Bears legend and Super Bowl champion Steve McMichael was admitted to the ICU on Thursday as he battled a urinary tract infection, his family said in a statement. According to ABC7 in Chicago, McMichael was admitted to Silver Cross Hospital outside of Chicago as he dealt with a fever. The former defensive tackle, who was diagnosed with ALS in 2021, was previously hospitalized last summer with sepsis and pneumonia. Steve is fighting a urinary tract infection, his family wrote Thursday. He is on three antibiotics and is being admitted to the ICU this evening. Continued prayers are appreciated for Steve's speedy recovery. Thank you. McMichael's most recent health battle comes just a week after the Chicago Great was elected to the Pro Football Hall of Fame. Surrounded by family and former Bears teammates, McMichael learned of his inclusion in this year's class while at his home outside of Chicago. I know this means an awful lot to Steve and his family and I'm sure to all Bears fans and his teammates, former Bear Gary Fensick said, according to the team's website. McMichael, 66, spent 13 of his 15 seasons in the NFL with the Bears, earning two trips to the Pro Bowl and getting named an All-Pro twice. He played an integral role on the vaunted 1985 defense, racking up eight sacks along with 44 tackles en route to winning Chicago's first and only Super Bowl. Three years later, McMichael recorded a career-best 11.5 sacks and 88 tackles. His 92.5 sacks with the Bears rank second in franchise history while his 814 solo tackles rank third.